Now, I imagine this next story was pretty fun to cover as a journalist. A flathead man has coined himself the ultimate Grizz fan, and to prove his loyalty, had a Grizz paw painted on a crown in the back of his mouth. Our Marn Sue is in Kalispell with this story. My brother thought I was crazy. He didn't think it was actually for real, and, and my friends, they kind of know me well enough to know that I would go about doing that. This is Scott Williams, the self-proclaimed ultimate Grizz fan. And this is Scott's tooth with a Grizz crown. Williams has been in the Flathead for over 30 years and tells me this is just another piece of Grizz memorabilia to add to his collection. The mastermind behind this is Dr. Joel Booth. He explains to me how this process works. We prepare the tooth in-house um, and then send it to a lab and the lab actually fabricates it, stains it, glazes it, and then sends it back. But as far as the designing and everything, me and the patient sat down, talked about the color, what he wanted on it. Not a very common practice. Dr. Booth tells me where he got this idea. When we were in dental school, we had someone do a, a Michigan crown, a solid blue M crown. So I mentioned that to the patient. These tooth tattoos are put in patient's teeth the same way a regular crown would be. Dr. Booth tells me a patient can essentially get a tooth tattoo anywhere a crown can be put in, either in the front or the back of the mouth. The Grizz tooth is holding up well. Dr. Booth tells me the tattoo will undergo normal signs of wear and tear, but it's unlikely that the Grizz paw will wear off. In Kalispell, I'm Marin Siu, MTN News. Williams tells us he's ready for another tooth tattoo and is thinking of possibly getting another Grizz paw on the other side of his mouth.